Good morning, folks. Uh, this morning, I want to talk a little about sharp. You know, um, there's a lot of roosters out there that people put through a keep and they start reducing the feed the last three days of the keep. Okay, the reason you reduce the feed the last three days of the keep is so that your rooster can start coming on point. Once you got your rooster on point at the pit, it's up to you to keep the gizzard functioning so that he doesn't go over on you. Once he drops the uriate drop, which is your third drop, and it's the dime size, a creamy white dime size dropping, that means your rooster is gut empty and he will be sharp, okay? And he will be considered what you call on point, sharp, meaning uh, no feed inside the intestinal tract, okay? Once he gets sharp, it's up to you and on point to keep his gizzard functioning throughout the day to keep him on point, okay? I personally like to keep my roosters on point and sharp. That way, when I step into the pit and I start building my rooster up, at least I know when I go back to the score line and I set my rooster down, he's gonna run across or fly across and try to kill his opponent, okay? This is a rooster that's sharp. A rooster that's not sharp, the majority of the times you can build him up Take him back to your eight foot score line and he'll just stand there and wait for his opponent or wait for his opponent to come to him to start, you know, fighting with him. But I like to have that edge. I like to be able to strike first. I like to be able to hit you on impact and cut you first. That way, at least I know that I've already done damage to you, you know, and you're already hurt. If not dying, you're already hurt. So that is what I like to do with my chickens is get them sharp keep them on point throughout the day that way like i said when i meet you in the pit my rooster's gonna fly across or run across and strike at your rooster and cut you uh this is just something i wanted to say about sharpness and on point of a rooster